Time for Fortnite. <laughs> All right, we're doing this right now. <laughs> I'm, now I'm emotionally compromised. The Mario 3. Who would have thought the heel turn would come from Mitch? Mitch's hate of the Beatles. The biggest band of all time. This is a party. I didn't diss chat, he dissed chat, guys. I trust your opinions. Look what the Beatles have caused already. Like, this is all the Beatles, right? You now. better fucking get this, this is, one too. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. But this is all the Beatles. This is look what they're causing right now. We just didn't even talk about it. We'd all be having a good time. <laughs> fucking Beatles strikes again, man. Fucking band. God damn it. Oh man. I did it though, 292. We did it. Yeah, he's objectively great. What's your opinion on the Rolling Stones? I'm not talking about this. Anymore. Just do it. Just no. say it. I don't I I don't have an opinion on the Rolling Stones, so I'm not going to That's it. I'm here to play Mario 3. That's it. I'm here to cooperatively play Mario 3. Uh, no, not the same thing, Gamat. That's not the same thing at all, because you're talking about years and years of, uh, objectively, no matter what anyone says, like, popular, well-received work, compared to work that's definitely not popular, nor well-received, nor good. You know what I mean? For what? Those what those would be a different a different comparison. His analogy he had. <laughs> Rush, ah, uh, I don't really like Rush that much either. I'm not a huge fan of Rush. What does Rush have to do with this? The Rush is somebody, a fine somebody band. Asked, somebody asked Rush. <laughs> They're a fine band. They're not Beatles level. <laughs> Most people who think the Beatles are overrated feel strongly about the Rolling Stones. I feel like that's like a, um, that's like Star Trek Star Wars, you know what I mean? Where people feel like you can only like one but can't like the other. Which is ridiculous. You can like Star Trek and Star Wars. Rush is just Getty Lee. <clears throat> I'd probably, well obviously I'd pick Rush over the Beatles, but I don't even like much of, much Rush, to be honest. Pink Floyd. So you like don't even like much Rush, but you're like, yeah, but I, obviously I pick them over the Beatles. Like, like what band would you pick the Beatles over then? Like, where are we getting to? Like, None. how low are we going? None. They're like the worst band of all time in your opinion. See, like I feel like it's it's it's. I feel like you the you were saying I had a positive emotional response. I'm very to the like, like I'm very instrumental when it comes to like music. Like I don't I don't need people to speak to me through lyrics for me to have. To understand music at an emotional level, I don't need lyrics or singing. I'm, I'm more instrumental. I feel music through instruments. So, like, th that's obviously why I would pick Rush over the Beatles. They're not overly skilled at the instruments that they play on in, in the Beatles. That's why, you know, that, that is a large portion. Like, I love Jimi Hendrix. He's one of my favorite artists because he's so fucking good at guitar. Like, I feel him at that level. But, you know, I would still, I'd pick Pink Floyd over, over the Beatles, sure. Even though, like, their music's I'm not like saying that's not, I'm not saying that's not an acceptable opinion. That's a no, fine opinion. No, dude, I, I get that I makes, get where you're coming from. A lot from. of people, that makes, I think a lot of people would pick yeah. Pink Floyd over the Beatles all the time. I, I get that. I, I totally get where you're coming from. Saying they're overrated is a compromisable assumption based. <laughs> yes, no, I get that. Okay. I get that. Okay. It'd be like Justin Bieber better than Beatles. <laughs> okay. Okay, I, I can I know, but like, Georgia Harris, that's what I'm saying, like, the Beatles have, like, soup, they were... There's a lot of amazing music, no words, in their songs. What do you mean? Like, on a, on a skillful level? Yes! They're not... <laughs> Dude, they have a song where, where this, the same thing re repeats. That's it. It's just one beat oh, throughout no. the whole song. Wait, is it? Oh my god, I thought that was me controlling. We were literally doing the same, <laughs> same thing. Okay. 
I mean, yeah, a lot of songs, things repeat. I mean, I've, I've very rarely heard a song where things don't repeat, ever. Well, when I say repeat, I'm saying that the entire song is just the repeat of one thing. And that's not overly skillful. Like, I, lo I They made, like, 62 <laughs> albums. <laughs> they made, like, 900 billion albums. <laughs> Please go. I'm going, I'm going. It's, it's hard, man. It's hard. I'm being put on the spot so hard for this. I'm not saying you can't have an outlandish opinion, I'm just saying... Whew. Yeah, I mean, I'm not saying that every song, every one of their songs is like fucking like... Neither am I. Up. Yeah, that's Neither am I. I'm not saying any of that stuff. I, I just use yeah. an example. I just use one example. Will Mozart be at MMC? Quality over quantity? Well, I'm, I'm saying they, they have plenty of quality, okay? They've had enough quality. But if you're 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 cherry picking one bad song and being like, this is the reason, like, I, and we could do that with with Beethoven, I'm sure. Like, I'm sure his some of his early work was not that hot. You know what I mean? So that would be, I, I don't know. Yeah, if your if your value as a speedrunner was judged by your worst run, was judged by the last six resets well, I, we just did. Well, I, I I mean I never said no. I never said like any song. I, I was just using an example. I never valued them based off their worst. I've listened to them. I don't like them. That's like what do you want from me? Like this sucks right now. You guys are all throwing me on the spot about a whole bunch of garbage, and I'm being like critiqued so hard by every little thing I'm saying. Like this sucks right now. It's not that this, big a deal. This, we're, this, we're, we're talking every, about the everyone, Beatles. It's not that big a deal. It doesn't suck. It's just I'm like getting, I'm getting chopped here. You can't. You can't. Okay. You can't just say something and then just be like, oh, that's just how it is. Not defending it. Mic drop. Like that's not. That's that's not how the world works. Like you, you I, say something. You say something that other people deem crazy. They're gonna want to understand why. You, hey, you came to that conclusion. I explained that's it. All. I explained it. I I already explained it. I. I, I don't think I think you think you explain it. I don't think I I don't feel that. I did I did exp I explained why I like music and why I don't like the Beatles. Definitely, definitely. So I'm on the chopping block here, man. Yeah. I'm on the chopping block. It doesn't suck. You're not getting you're not on trial. You're not gonna get okay. your hand cut Look at off. This. I'm getting. We're not shaming Beethoven. Be no, the Beatles will not be at MMC. <laughs> so I take it. I asked Ringo, but he was busy. Fucking Beatles. <laughs> I think they make people crazy, man. They make people nuts. No. You guys are nuts. No. I was having a good day. I was getting peace speed and everything. Life was good. We're, we were routing. It was all great, and then no, boom, the Beatles was, came into play. No, it I was should when never said, have read the message. No, 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 no. What, what, what made, what made me keep your mouth shut? No, keep, no, no. Keep you your saying, opinions you know, like, to yourself. I was, I was taken aback. I was just like, huh, that's strange. When you said you don't like the Beatles, it was, it was when you were like, their, their music isn't, isn't good enough for you. Or like not allowed. like that, that, complicated that's allowed. That's allowed. or or which is allowed. People yeah, are allowed yeah, yeah, to yeah. share that. But then that. like then like they're overrated or super simple or anyone could have wrote their songs, which was okay. out, that was an outlandish I see, statement. I can see I can see that, but we're still like talking about that. Like we like we haven't even let that go yet. Like because because like, because it was uh yeah. We, and I admitted that. that that was definitely not the right thing to say. You know that's something you say to yourself in the shower. I know, you, but you don't you don't tell people that. I, I admit that. I admit that we're still going on about. That though, we're still. This is like 20 minutes later. We're still flabbergasted by by what I said. We're still going. Harping on this too much. I kind of agree. I don't know what else more I can say. Like I feel like I have to apologize at this point and be like, sorry, nations of, <laughs> of everything. I will. I will bide my my thoughts on the Beatles. See, that's not what you, see, that's not fair. That's not what anyone said. You can't, no one's saying you can't have thoughts on it. I, I just wanted to understand your thoughts. I was asking for an, an explanation of those thoughts. I, Dad, I, dads, please stop playing. You know, that's all. <laughs> see, and then you, and then, it, you, then you're like, 
It's like it's like beetle victim shaming you're doing over here. I, like, that, I feel like that's what's happening right now. I feel like I feel like I'm sleeping on the couch tonight. Like, what you the, know like, what I mean? Like, what's like, going on like, here? And like, <laughs> the, the, the bacon, it's still <laughs> fucking going. Like no, no, no! Now, going. now I'm mocking. Now I'm mocking your vic your victimness of of people people questioning uh, an outlandish opinion. That's like I'm making a press conference that, tomorrow about you know, how much I like the Beatles. Like I'm 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 gonna go home and listen to all their albums. I'm gonna listen to it all. I gotta relate. I can't I can't do this. I can't live in a in a Beatle hate world anymore. I can't do it. It's not working for me. It's not working for me anymore. I can't do it. You're focusing on the wrong issue here. No. If I just liked the Beatles, I would never say all the wrong things. No, that has nothing like to do with them. anything. I just gotta like them. No, that has nothing to do with anything. We need an official... Yeah, you, yeah, press, press conference, apology. Please don't jump. He jumps. How do we even know the patterns? Do you remember what it is? Uh, I got the use box. You have, you have hammer. Yeah, so I need hammer. <laughs> uh, can we stream, actually stream a press conference though? My ignorance towards needles. It's true. Purple, but a handful of songs that were truly noteworthy? Like, isn't that like way more than 98% of artists have? What handful would that be? And that would be my argument. Yes, their cultural importance. <laughs> and that's where my ignorance comes in. See, that's why I should never say what I said. It was, it was ignorant to history. I apologize, guys, okay? I get it. I get it. It's, it's, they have grave importance. They they given Jesus. Yeah. They said they they did say that in, in one of their What? In one of their interviews. They were interviewed once and they, they said that they were bigger than Jesus. They probably were at the time, like given how many people believe in Jesus in the world versus how many people were listening to the Beatles. Yeah. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't doubt dis that. I wouldn't yeah. disregard that. I can easily see why me saying that they're overrated, why that causes problems. I can see that. That I can't deny that. And it, it, it is a form of ignorance. I get it. No, I'm not saying you're ignorant. But it is, right? I mean, I was saying you're in, wrong. In, in, a, in a historical... <laughs> There's no way out. There's no way out. There's no way out. No, no, you're fine. This but totally different. This is why London was shot. <laughs> oh my god. This is funny. Good <laughs> for you, yeah. okay? At least we got Mario 3. Yeah, the Mario 3 makes wild. it okay. <laughs> this was all because of asking if the Beatles would be at MMC. <laughs> oh my god. This is funny. <laughs> SMB3 is overrated? No, it's pretty properly rated. I think it's rated as one of the greatest games of all time, and I don't think there's really any denying it's one of the greatest games of all time. It was the NES number one selling, I'm pretty sure. Right? Okay. Uh, I bet Mario won just because it came with the system for so long. Although, okay, I will say Mario 3 has some of the worst level design at some points. It has some of the it has the best and worst level design in the Mario. What would you say would be like are you are you seven four seven, one? I was gonna seven say. four one is a bad level. That's, that fort's really bad too. Yeah, that's yeah. They, they ran out of ideas, so they came up with trolls. Yeah. Okay, so what do we? Do keep keep going. Wee. We battle. We battle. Okay. We battle. MFP flower oh, boost swag. And, and then, then I, you die. I die. Yeah. Yo, thirty eight months. Welcome back, Trivia. It's rated number three all time on Wikipedia. Um, yeah, just incredible, but, I mean, Mario 3 didn't come out till the end of the SMB 1's life cycle, so... It was actually game 500. 500 and something. So there was still another 200 and some games left, I think. There you go. I think we had... I think we had, we had some from oh. chat. You can actually check, check a list to see what game numbers...
I think SMW's level design never hits the bottom that SMB3's level design does. I think there there are some incredibly questionable levels in SMB3. I that think being said, Mario Bros. levels are better than Mario 3. Yeah, that being said, like, it's, I, I think, yeah, I think if you know the reason Mario World, just, they're so long. They get to be so long. I'm never gonna get over this. That was funny. That was I'm funny gonna be thinking about this for so long. Every time it, not, my experience is tainted now. I'm gonna listen to the Beatles. And I'm gonna think about. Well, you're just gonna be mad. You're I'm gonna think gonna about when mad. Dad and Dad got divorced yeah, over an argument. I, I don't know. I feel like I, I I feel like I wonder where you were. Like I wanna I wanna warp back to like. You know, like ten year old Mitch. This like, is how it all starts. Your life. This is how it starts with the Beatles. Someone's like, You never heard of the Beatles? Then you get pressured into the Beatles. That's, 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 and, that's and that's what you makes people hate it. It's like it's like In and Out. It. It's like what we do with In and Out. Us Californians do with In and Out. We ruin it for people by by forcing it on them so much. That's why everyone hates Fortnite so much. You know what I mean? They would actually love it. But they've been. Everyone tells them they love it so much. That they're like, "Fuck that! You I'm not gonna love it." You gotta play Fortnite. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna love it. Fortnite, exactly. You know? Exactly. It's the same thing. It's I got the. the I got that with the Beatles. I'm not gonna lie. Yes. I didn't get it with Jimi Hendrix, and I fucking love him. I found him in my own well, way. I don't. I know? don't think. I think Jimmy's less like. Probably like less universal, you know oh, what I mean? Less. Like everyone knows him, but nobody want nobody needs especially, you to hear their music. Especially because in the '90s, the when they they released all those Beatle anthologies, so they were like big again, you know what I mean? Yeah. So they they were hitting like the nostalgia and like a like they were almost like pop songs again, you know what I mean? So I I, I get that. No, I get that. And I think I, I I'm not denying that. I I think that happens to a lot of people with a lot of things. God knows there's probably something in my life where I'm like I just fucking hate it because everybody else loved it. You know? I don't know. I don't know. Every, every time I've ever dealt with anything that's to do with the Beatles ends <laughs> in me with my back in the back of a cage, like totally just getting annihilated yeah. by somebody who just likes the Beatles. And I just, I say the wrong thing all the time. I, I never, I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do. Milk and bags versus milk and cartons, you know? What is, what is Lord of the Rings? Lord of the Rings has nothing to do with Game of Thrones at all, in any shape, form, or fashion. Other than the fact that both of them feature castles. That is literally the only thing they have to do with each other. I've read enough. I read enough of The Hobbit, had it read to me, on stream to understand that. Well, lots of people say that all music sucks nowadays, and that's such a, like a loaded thing. Like oh, the music no, that's I'm true. listening to right now is fucking amazing. I I think like, new music is awesome. I'm finding the right music for me. Not, yeah. Not, like I'm not turning on fucking much music or MTV and listening to. I don't know. I think genres can have down years, but new music is always going to be good, no matter Back what. Concerts it's just like the best yeah. thing ever. It's just you're getting old, and we all get, like, stuck in our own, like, if there's one thing I've learned about musical taste, it's like we definitely kind of get stuck with what, what we dug at a certain point in our life. You know what I mean? That's why oldie stations exist. I don't know if you've ever heard of an oldie station. That's always on in our car. Yeah. Always. We listen to that on the way to the airport. Yeah. I don't think MTV shows music anymore, no. I, <laughs> Mitch, well, I was... Mitch, Mitch hasn't listened to music, watched MTV since 85. I said MTV because we don't actually get MTV in Canada, but I feel like if I said much music, you guys wouldn't <laughs> Is there MTV can Oh, much music! Oh my god, I, we get much music in here, though. We get much music. You guys get much music? If you have satellite, you get much music. And that's yeah. what I grew up with, much music. Oh, with, shit. With George Strombolopoulos. <laughs> he used to be on much music before he moved. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, I, I go out and, like, I search for new music. I always listen to, like, new albums and stuff like that. I'm just getting into, like, yeah. this new stuff. But I'm way more instrumental than I am. John the Great, Cla else. classic rock stations keep expanding though. Nirvana gets played on classic rock stations because they're fucking old. Nirvana, Nirvana was almost 30 years ago. Like that's old. That's <laughs> yeah, you you just you just made your you just you don't realize it, but you're getting old. <laughs> and the music you liked growing up is old. Yeah. That's just classic rock. <laughs> yeah, that's... <laughs> Makes you appreciate, like... Yeah, you, man. You can still find Led Zeppelin on the radio. Like, yeah. it's not hard, you know what I mean? The, the fact that they're still on, just... Yeah. Y'all, the Chronic, the Chronic came out, like, 27 years ago, man. Dr. Dre's old as shit. 
Yeah. I don't like hip hop, but I respect him, man. That well, you see, and that that's I in I get that because like, how can you not like Dr. Dre? He's like, it's so hard to not at least appreciate what he does. I do, I don't like hip hop strictly because of the way the music is portrayed, but the things that they're saying and the way that they were like, it's just so so funny. He would good. be he would be one that crosses the genre barriers that I was talking about earlier with our previous example. Oh, I'm def I'm definitely aware of that stuff. It, it, it's, I still. <laughs> but classic rock should mean 60s or 70s. Yeah, if you're really, really old, but cla you know, like that's that's what happens. Like a, a classic car when I was growing up was a, a 50s and 60s car, but now it would be. You know, time time moves in a linear fashion. I feel <laughs> that's like how it works. The title of this should be "Getting Old with Two. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're we're really killing it right now. <laughs> Yo, we're still ahead right yeah. now. We're ahead right now. Yeah. Yeah. I love it, yeah. It was rock, and then it got old, and now it's classic rock. My two favorite songs are Easily Guilty Conscious and Forgotten About Dre. Some really good songs. So you like Eminem? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you like Eminem? Uh, I feel like Eminem was more of like a Blink-182. You had to be like young and like relatable to like really fully get it right like when i listen to eminem i'm not i'm not like oh yeah you know that's kind of like how life is for me too right now like where shit sucks you yeah know? eminem's overrated i'll say that one <laughs> it's situational like it's just too situational like 182 like <laughs> I, now i'm gonna get skewered here <laughs> Y'all, compare him to Big Boy. Compare him to Andre 3000. Compare him to Rakim, Biggie, fucking Tupac. Get out of here. <laughs> oh man. Uh, I love I love between the barrier to me. I think I think they're some of the best things. I also love uh, animals as leaders. I think they're some of the some of the most impressive music playing I've ever heard in my life. What was that? Yo, Chunky Monkey with the gift sub. Thank you so much. That was do you. That was do you. Yeah, yeah. Does you know anyone what? know Tone Loke? He Tone Loke does voice acting for a lot of different cartoons now. He's a big voice actor. We're watching this world four, I love it. Yeah, I feel like people have been added to that list though. All this music stocks kill the run. No way. There can't be goats. Goats isn't a thing. Actually, I make that argument all the time. They're getting more to the greatest. They're the greatest of eras. Oh my god. Double Indian Post Malone is hard for me because I understand that his music is objectively bad, but I can't not, like, enjoy it. Like, I get that, like, what I'm hearing is not good in any shape, form, or fashion, but I just, I can't not enjoy it. Like, I, I always enjoy it, you know? Like, I, it's so weird. I haven't heard much of his stuff. Oh my god, it all, it's, every song sounds exactly the same, but it works! I don't know what it is, man. Yeah, Post Malone is like, it's like, he's like the, like, box candy of, of music. Box candy. Yeah, it's like it's bad for you, but you know it's bad. Yeah, like like something just like slathered in sugar. You still walk to the store. You still go. Yeah, to the man, but you still like you know. Yeah, I don't know. I, oh I, yeah. I mean, I'm all I'm all around. Like I, I like I like metal and hip hop and stuff like that. But it's like it's you know everyone likes their everyone likes their own thing. Like I don't I don't know if you like much metal at all. 
but there's probably some metal songs oh, where yeah. you hear it and you respect it. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. Yeah. Like, everyone likes their own thing. It's hard to hate all style of music. Like, there's genre yeah. genre crossers, yeah. If I don't like the Beatles, it doesn't mean that I don't like what the Beatles represented musically. <laughs> I was not going to bring up the Beatles again. <laughs> that, well, no, that, that's a fair point. That Just because I don't like them doesn't mean I don't like, you know classic rock or you know whatever they stood for and stuff like that like i love i love all that stuff you know what guys i'm jealous i wasn't in the band Beatles, that's why i just go around and see all this fat shit no i just think like i don't like I country see... but country still has a very big importance i, I don't like country i no. just all i'm seeing right now is like mitch like 11 years old and he's like, likes this girl. Like, likes so I was gonna Beatles, say, likes this girl. Likes the Beatles. Likes this girl who's, and she's like, oh, do you listen to the Beatles? And Mitch is like, no, I never heard them. And then she's like, <laughs> and then like since then it's just been like, <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, that was that was it. And that was it. He's just like, fuck, fuck you, Paul McCartney. Fuck you, Ringo. <laughs> Since then, man, I'm, I just say the wrong things all the time. That's it. And then every and ever since then, like each time he each time he's nah, I just didn't listen to him. It's like it's this, you know what I mean? So it becomes like it's like a war. I'm with it. He just he just described this music. Yeah, I, I, I like mostly all kinds of music. I I don't listen to country, but I mean I can see why people like it. It's not that bad. Like it's not that bad, right? If it's I like, relatable, why is it not, uh, uh, you know, it's, it's I like, appealing to people. I like Garth Brooks. I don't necessarily, I, there's, I would say Bad Country is, is more propped up than any other genre's bad music, if that makes sense. I can't relate to shooting up banks and stealing money in hip-hop, but what I can relate to is amazing rhymes and amazing sentences that go with those rhymes. That's dope. Yeah. Okay, so that's why I like it. What kind of? What the? What is the last song about? Oh, I guess Mask Off. I was gonna say is the last. There Robin is. Song. Well, that song is. But yeah, I mean, hip hop. Hip hop's way farther but about than that. Now. I never said that that was hip hop. I'm just saying, you know, whenever people sing about stuff like that, you know, I can't relate. Or, or whenever, like, death metal, they sing about, like, murder and stuff. Like, I can't relate to that. I'm, no. the, I'm, the, I'm not enjoying that. I don't give a fuck about that. So I don't, I don't like, like it. your lyrical content Yeah, here. exactly. I, lyrical content is very important for me. Country music is the, that's the one genre that I think its fans prop up its shittiest version more than any other music. EDM would be second. That's and that's saying that there's not good. I really like Garth Brooks. I think Zed's dope. I think I think some some techno and stuff like that is some of the easiest music to get. It's easy, right? You can be lazy at it. You you listen to it, you're like, don't beat for five minutes. You're like, okay. It's it's, it's beat, hard to the hate. The beat drops. Yeah, it's and hard. It comes to, back. It's hard to hate. There's nothing. There's not much to it. Yeah, it's it's hard to hate. And then you get awesome DJs who can like flip it around and turn it into it's so a much. Show. More. Yeah, and it gets insane. It, the music turns into like light shows. And stuff uh, like that. One of the rights to Wing. That's Pee Wing. Yeah, they switch. Do we need them? I don't, I think, don't we need think we them. need them. We don't need the music box either. Death metal bands like Obscura don't talk about murder. Well, I I didn't say like they do. I'm just you you can't deny the fact that there has been at least one death metal song that relates to like Wait, talks about that. Right? You say they don't talk about murder so many layers and whatnot. What does that mean? So they do talk about murder, just not all the time. Is that what you were insinuating? I mean, there's got to be some bands that do. Got to be some murder. Yeah, see, but I'm gonna fight this guy now. Well, you know, it's the way of the road. <laughs> no, it's not the way of the road. That's how she goes. You can't leave without me. That's how she goes. Can of course, it definitely does. Uh, I don't know. I, don't know. I like I like concept albums, albums that relate to a story. You know, listening listening to song three, you won't understand because you didn't listen to song one and two. You know, stuff like that. Concept albums are really good. I like you know, I like stuff like that. Everyone likes what they like. You really like uh, D'Angelo's second album, though. <laughs> it all flows together into one thing. It's like my favorite album ever. But it's also super soft love music. Hey, I like love music.
Doesn't one death metal band drink blood from skulls? Is it real blood or real skulls? I doubt it. We all know it's cranberry juice, guys. Yeah. It's not blood. Yeah, I think I'm gonna bring a piece of paper with us and just write down what each of us have the whole time so I can just easily look at it and be like, alright, we need this or that. How do I feel about Tool? Damn, man. Tool's crazy. That's it. That's what I'm gonna say. That can go both ways. That can go both ways, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm not. You guys don't need to know what I like, okay? And what I don't like. That's where I stand. I like, not love said popular band you just stated. <laughs> I like, but not love, said popular band you just stated. <laughs> yes, they have, they have... Watch Duster? I've never heard of them before. Fine, fine music. Uh, my favorite album from Tool is 10,000 Days, and obviously Vicarious is one of my favorite songs by Tool. I don't know, I don't know why, that, out of all the Tool songs, like, I've always liked Vicarious the most. I think that's, like, I, to me, it's a masterpiece, I don't, you know? I can't really relate to it, right? I feel like some... I feel like sometimes people on drugs can understand that more. And, like, I've been, I've been one of those people, I guess, who hasn't done drugs and listened to music before. I'm just saying, 10,000 days, these guys are gonna kill me. See? See, Jam... I knew Jambi was gonna... You can't talk to people about music without one person liking Jambi. Or, or Lateralis. Maybe it's possible. It's like when, when somebody says, I don't like Comfortably Numb from Pink Floyd, and everyone's like, how can you not like it? It's possible not like it. Animals as leaders is bad. Yes, stink fist. Dude. Any Sean fans? I've never heard Sean before. I don't know. Lola, I'll feed you in a minute. I feel like, I feel like she's doing that because I don't like the Beatles. She's I feel like that. that's exactly why she's doing that. No, she's doing it because she gets fed at five. She knows I usually get off at five. Like, she can tell. Oh, okay. And then she gets fed once I get off. So she's, like, literally saying, please feed me. <laughs> what? Shut the fuck up. Where are you going? There's no room back here. Oh man. She is, she's well trained, yeah. My Carries is your favorite song too, nice. <laughs> you have a cloud and a hammer, right? I'll open up I'll open up my inventory when well, I figure it out. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna find out right now, yeah. so. I'm pretty sure you do, though. I'm pretty sure you have to have a cloud and a hammer. Because I hammered three because it didn't block us. Beatles were the monkeys, but less talented. The monkeys? The monkeys, but less talented? Wait, what? Uh, I no, got you, nothing. You got nothing, okay. I'll just fight him and get the... This box. Right? Women I. But I like Southern playlists of Cadillac music is my favorite outcast album. Then AT Aliens and then. You guys remember the band the Arctic Monkeys? Monkeys? I don't know. Are they still a thing? My my all-time favorite band is the Mars Volta. And they're weird as fuck. They're not like your average. But you don't show people the Mars Volta if you're like, yo, like this music. That's not that's not what you do. You don't like I wouldn't show who the Mars Volta and be like, yeah, you like this? Like I wouldn't do that. Okay, so what happened there was you didn't I love was that. Was that the world like four? Was that the there was the world four Okay, so I, okay, I think I, ideally you get the World 4 Hammer Brother, and that's just what happened was it didn't work out in the ideal way. 
because he was right past the block. So we want the world for him brother to run away. So you can get him. Yeah. Yeah, so Luigi can get him. Because then, then that would have worked out perfect. Like, everything we would have done there would have worked out completely perfect. It was close. And then we wouldn't have had to battle. I was listening to the Arctic Monkeys in high school, so that was over ten years ago. So I, so I think as a band, they're, they're slightly old. They're getting old to the older band genre. Like, if you ask the band that's been together for ten years, like, you guys, have you guys been around for a while? They would probably be like, yeah, like, I think we've been together for a while. They're not old. Okay. Yo, T Swift's music's catchy as fuck, man. That's why I hate it. <laughs> I'll listen to that. I'm like, oh, yo, this is so good. Why? I don't get it. Blank space is. That's my. I, just, I love that that's song. That's my favorite song. I love that song. <laughs> I mean, it's like I'm not even gonna lie. I just legitimately. I'm proud to admit I know all the lyrics. Yeah, so like, I legitimately you. just like that song. All right, so we need a battle, and you win. Bought me. Yeah. Arctic Monkeys released an album this year. Well, I'm glad I asked oh, perfect. if people, perfect. you know, I'm glad I asked that then. Perfect. I can screen transit some. Do you need the hammer? No? Mm, uh, no. Oh, wait, no, I can't no. screen transit. Yeah, no. It doesn't matter, yeah. Oh, and I'm small Mario, too. That's, that's perfect. I think... Small Luigi. I think I'm big Mario. I don't know what I am. Just shake it off? Nah, not as good as my space. No, blank space is really I good. can hear blank space when it's being played like in malls and like airports, like in the background. Like it's such a distinct, like I know it. It's a distinct sound. You hear it, you're like, yeah. Okay, so whoever Like like I would I would say that Lamb of God is also one of my favorite bands too. Like I like I like them a lot as well. Okay, we have to figure out who needs to get the cloud. That's all we have to figure out. You don't in you don't have a P wing either. I just realized I'm not gonna. Person, make this. The person who gets the cloud is the person who has to do seven four. So the person who beats the world does seven one. Then. So the person who beats the world needs to have the cloud. Because the person who beats the world will do seven one. Then the other person do seven two. The other person do seven three. Then they then they battle. Then that's it. Well, they don't need to battle though. We could we could avoid battling if we. Have the person who doesn't beat the world gets the cloud. Well, I don't have a P wing, which is perfect. So you're you're gonna be doing this. I'm so sorry. I, I wanted to make sure I didn't get P speed there. No, you're fine. This is this is all working out so far. So far. Uh, no, not anymore. Not anymore. Uh, no, ass ketchup. Let's not do that. Plus that, I don't think we're allowed to do that on Twitch anymore. I am so good at saying yeah, the have, wrong things have, at the wrong time. Yeah, I have all the P wings. That's good. That's kind of like what we were slightly anticipating. Yeah. I think life's better when I keep to myself a little bit more than the average person. I'd rather not talk so, about music and offend people. All right, guys. I you I want you to beat the world. So then I'll get the cloud. I think that's... Oh, I, don't I don't know if I fucked it. I don't know. What... No, we didn't, we didn't fuck it up. Did he say ass ketchup? ketchup? That's right. I'm gonna fight this hammer brother because you have the hammer. No, you can screen scroll. Yeah, oh, I have the hammer. hammer, that's right. wasn't a way for you to just go over and hit the hammer to like bop it. Yo, this fortress small. Oh, big jump. Man, 
So it's kind of good that I didn't grab that mushroom then. Yeah, I just, I just realized. I just realized you're gonna have to wall jump. Mm. Okay, so the one place we screwed up was not getting a P wing to. To me. Yeah, to you. That was Which, the one thing we screwed up. That and that was my fault because I P winged or I had music box in Bolt Yeah, five. that was my fault. Actually, the I think the play is going to the top, like, getting, you should have got the P-Wing, gone to the top, and then used the music box to make sure I don't get the second one. Maybe, I don't know, maybe I'm just a complete idiot. And maybe we just burned the extra music, no, because we have two music boxes. Oh, I didn't even mean, I swear to God. No! I don't know if I've ever seen this level. Because <sighs> I got the pixel. I was excited. Yeah. That wasn't that bad. That, that was not that much time. No. We can still beat this. Yeah. With a very... That'll be okay. Die? No. Because that will mess everything up. I've run 100% before. You still don't see that level. John the Great. You go over that level. Yeah, there's no there's no situation in speedrunning Mario 3 where you ever go in that fight. Yeah. As long as it doesn't take me 10,000 years to clip... In 7-1, we're inevitably gonna save time. We might lose time in this world. And you have a music box, right? How did I know so well? I've done a level before. You have a music box? Mm -hmm. You do? Okay. Mm -hmm. I got the one in World 5. Okay. Cause I got blank space. Oh, I gotta suck in my song, man. You know, right, you know. Boys only want. Just talking about that song put it in our heads. Do you know the music video, too? Oh, I love the music yeah. video. <laughs> <laughs> I have it. There's a. 8 Bit Universe did uh, just the Taylor Swift 1989 album. Like, usually they just pick, like, random pop songs, but they did just that album <laughs> in 8-bit, and it was fucking great. Yeah, it was really good. Yeah. I get a P-Wing from this world, yes. Yeah, so I'll have a P-Wing for the Fortress. And then Pooh Bear, I think he has a P-Wing anyway. Yeah, you just need to get big. Yeah, you need to get big, and then we're gonna, we're actually gonna be fine. And then we'll Do you be... have a music box, though? You need a music box. Yeah. Um... I don't think you do. You need a music box. You're passing the Piranha Plan, not me. I'm clouding seven four. Not you. Oh, it doesn't. It doesn't matter who has the, the two music boxes. We can just do it for each other. Oh, without the first one. I can't music box for you before I do the fortress in world seven because you have to deal. Like I'm doing the first fortress in world seven. I'll be doing the first fortress because Whee! it'll go. You're gonna play one. I'm well, gonna I play two. Know. You're gonna play three. I'm gonna go over four. Play the first castle. You're going to then okay, go okay. back. Okay, yeah, no, yeah, that, works, that works, that works, that works. Yeah. Yo, welcome back for eight months. I think the one thing we might have messed up, and this is my fault, I think I, maybe I was supposed to get the cloud now that I think about it. Whoever does, or whoever doesn't beat it gets the cloud. Right, but I could be wrong. Split. Okay. We're still doing pretty good. This is where we can save a lot of time. It yeah, that was probably over here. Yeah, that, that was just probably the wall jump. So, yeah, I mean, if this, I tell you right now, because this is definitely a sloppier run than we did last time. If this comes out and we're like still like 15, 20 ahead, like it's def this is definitely the right round. Mm -hmm. and, oh, yeah, this is gonna work. Yeah, and even even if we we might have to battle once, but all we did was. I should have got the cloud, if that's the case. We do have to battle. Wait, yeah. Come on, baby. Oh, come on. That was the pixel. This is such a bullshit thing. Oh, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Blame CRTs. Oh, double pixel. Way faster than last time. Yeah, so bad. Way faster than last time. <sighs> I 
It sounds like a logistical nightmare. It is. It is. It is. It's been really, it's actually been really complicated. It's really been, it's really flexed the brain a little bit today. It would have been fine if Tang Ang didn't point out smart strats. <laughs> Uh, I'd have to say the improv is my favorite part. Yeah. I feel like one of the dogs just like came by and farted in the room. Fucking dogs. Fucking dogs. Yeah, it's really fun. It'll take it'll take a little bit of routing no matter what we do. Not that pipe. We're not going in that fight. No, you can, three. Yeah, you can tell the difference between human and non-human fart. It's more gamey. No, it's more yeah. Like, it's it more feels like it's like yeah, it feels like it's just been there for years. <laughs> How are we gonna practice together after today? GDQX. GDQX. Yeah. That sucks. Hold left to see if it. Nah. Let me try that. <laughs> Shit. Uh -oh. Now menuing's all over the place. Yeah, so you should have a music box, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. In the cloud. Okay. I think the cloud, yeah, I think the only thing we screwed up was I should have gotten the cloud in last world, and that's it. But otherwise, it's completely fine. Are you sure? This scenario, I clouded over the fortress last time. Last round. In this scenario. You music box for me, remember? Oh, yeah, 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 you're right, you're right. Yeah. No, okay. I have the music, no, 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 you're good. Okay, oh, no, shit. I think we, no, no, I think we, I think we'll be good. I think we'll be good. So now you music box. You, not yet, obviously, not yet. Not, yet. not until we get out of the pipe. Dude, it's hard to do these pipe transitions backwards. You always feel like you gotta go to the right whenever you go through them. Look at your weird M on the side, you see that? Like, I've never seen that before, so honestly. Weird. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah, if I because if I had the cloud, then we wouldn't have to battle again. We're gonna have to battle. I know we have to battle one yeah. more time. So if I that's the only thing we did wrong. Otherwise we did everything else right. And that would have worked out great. This is hot though. That it's definitely the hot strat. Tanging, do you know where we went wrong? Because I got the is it the hammer no, not the hammer in three. Uh, no, so I would need to get both hammers was where it went wrong. Is that where- well, I finished world five. Oh, wait, no. Did I? Where did you get the hammer? No, you had the class, so you finished world five. Yeah. But then we, we had to battle five. again. We had to, we had to battle because I needed- the, you had the ha Yeah. You- I had the hammer, but not the cloud. That's then, right, yeah. so I couldn't beat world five, so we had to- we had to switch at the end of world five, then you beat world five, then we had to switch again at the end of world six. So I think one person having two hammers with the cloud. Yeah. There seems to be a, a pattern here that once one person starts beating the world, it all it all works in favor for them anyways. Yeah. Right? Because I'm beating this world now. And I beat well, no, the, the last person world. who doesn't beat six gets the cloud in six. So the person who doesn't beat six would get the cloud. Is how we play it. But then again, all this can change if we get. You know, one extra hammer brother fucks us, you know, and it doesn't, you know, or whatever. I even think, like, what we're doing right now, like, people won't know. People will think that, like, we kind of have to do the stuff which we do anyways, right? Yeah. Like, we're gonna, we're gonna have to do these battles because it's not gonna, it's not gonna even come close to working out the way yeah. we, we want. 
wanted to, I guess. Yeah, I don't think... Yeah, so I think we put both hammers on Mario. Okay, so well, you, I have, guess you have the music box here, battle. Yeah. Right? Yeah, music box, battle, and then lose. Okay. At least we got that down. We're getting good we're at getting that. It. Yeah, we were so yeah. scrapey yesterday at first, yeah. trying to figure out where the fuck we were going. You would have more clothes. Yeah, that would have worked out great if we would have just had that. That's, I mean, that's that would have worked out really hot, though. We would have saved another 15 seconds. We, oh, yeah, yeah that's yeah. fast. Yeah, that's fast. Uh, I guess we got to count, though. It's about two minutes from here. We're going to be, yeah, close to a minute ahead. Another minute ahead. Yeah, I think that's definitely the route, though. This this run has the music debacle at the beginning of it. A guy's the not music. concerned with coming up with six strats that get stolen. No. no. First of all, first of all, this this run's super hyper specific in the fact that you would need two really good Mario 3 players in the same place at the same time recording. Thirdly, I'm not really worried about that happening at a at a marathon because this is fucking complicated. Nobody wants to fucking do this at a marathon, I realize, after doing it. No, I think it could be pretty fun. Yeah. Fourthly... I'm, I'm staying open to the idea. Like, I don't, yeah, yeah. I don't... I don't... Oh, no, not, like, learning it at a marathon. Like, some, no one's gonna try to break our record at a marathon, is oh, what I'm saying. Oh, yeah. No. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, nobody... Nobody... Like, it's People just, could, but I don't, I don't think yeah. people are gonna be like, you know what, I want to do this. Yeah. Yeah, nobody's gonna do it. You know who could? Darbian and Lack Attack. They could give it a run if they, uh... At Southern Speedrunner Jam, if Black Attack like went in, went in on Party Three for a little while. Yeah. Uh, no, this isn't for a race. This is this is for. Co-oper. Yeah, it's a co-op run at GDQX. Yeah. Also, speedrunners don't care. We're like we just share our strats with everybody. Yeah, that's the best part about coming up with strats is showing people like, look what we can do now. Yeah. It's so exciting. I remember when Tram were like, get so excited to show you the next day, like, like look what, like, I don't know. It's, it's, half, it's half, half of them I was just, I was like, oh, I don't want to fucking do that. Yeah, then half of them I was stupid. like, oh, I don't want to do that, but then I did do them and they weren't that bad. I was going to say, like, there's like three levels that have your strats in it and the run. And to, you convinced Tofu to do um, statue skip, which I was cracking up when I would go in there, and he's doing statue skip. He did that, yeah, he, man, he did that. Oh, hey. the other tank. Yeah, I was gonna say you can't go anywhere, man. You're stuck. You're stuck here. I gotta stretch. Oh wait. Oh, I did a really late split, and we were, so we're like 30 seconds down, I think. Yeah. What? Yeah, we're, we're down. You, right no, now. you stopped the timer. Oh, shit, it's, I did. There you go. Okay. Yeah, I split for us. Oh, okay. We're a minute oh, ahead. Okay. Oh, wow, we're a minute. Oh, wow. Did the timer stop or did it reload no, no, it where doesn't. it was? No, it reloads where it, where it goes. Yeah. Yeah. We can re-time it if we need, though. Yeah, try wave. This is awesome. Can someone confirm that the timer kept going? I'm pretty sure it does. We'll find out if we get all three hands and we save time. One hour behind. They caught bad. Yeah, the timer changed. Cool. Whee! Yeah, it was going. I figured it yeah, was going. Yeah. Marbles, 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 marbles. It jumped from 52 something to 53 something. Yeah, I was still going then. Um, the only split that matters is the first split and last split. Those are the only two that matter. That's why it's very, it's very important that we know that it kept going. Yeah, that was a good route change, man. Tanging, good, good, good GG, man. That was really good. Yeah, GG. That was, that was solid, dude. Was significantly faster though. Even, even with us. Not getting it completely right. Like we could have saved another 15 seconds there. Yeah, that was that was significantly faster.
Yeah, so basically... I for like five minutes straight. Mario gets... So Mario gets both hammers, and then Mario gets the cloud in... Oh, no, 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 no. That's not necessarily true. Wait. The, again, the... We want four. Luigi to get the cloud in four. Ideally, Luigi gets the... If, oh, okay. No, wait. Luigi gets the hammer and the cloud in four. That's the problem. It was the cloud in four went to Mario and not Luigi. That's right, because of the RNG, right? Yeah, because of the RNG. But if that hammer... So... Okay, so that's the real kicker. I say we still split hammers, then. Yeah, I say we still split hammers. That was the kicker. So Mario only beats World in one. Oh yeah. I mean, I guess he could beat World Four too. Well, whoever beats, whoever gets the hammer. No, that doesn't. Matter. Yeah, no, it does matter. Whoever gets the hammer beats World Three. No, because we both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so it doesn't. It doesn't matter. Matter. I say we keep splitting hammers, and then we just try to get Luigi the Cloud. Well, whoever beats World four. 2 has to beat World 3, because they have the Cloud, yeah. right? Whoever yeah. beats World 3 needs a hammer, or 4, or 4, because they need four, 3. And whoever gets the Cloud has to beat World 5, and whoever beats World 5 also has to have a hammer. So the person who uses a hammer cannot be the same person who gets the Cloud. Exactly. That's exactly it. I feel like we figured it all out. Oh, you got overkill, watch it. Hey, that sucked. Should've hit him with another hammer. Wait. Oh, the hands are gonna decide. Come on, no hands! Oh, you get no hands, just wait for me to unlock it. I know, that no, no, sucks. just kidding. That's not what fuck I wish it was. These stupid map designs. We ever played McKids? McKids is dope. I played with kids, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was just a, that was a little bad luck. Or good luck, depending on who you are, I guess. Just get early hammer solves actually early hammer might not solve any browning problems probably would add a whole crypto would make it way worse we, well we just wouldn't we just wouldn't hammer in the world before, that's all. which would make this whole run ass backwards so the critical points of randomness is world four Point. World 4, and well, and World 5. Basically, world in World 5 just depends on if we fight both, if we fight one Hammer Brother at the bottom, then we have to fight the other one at the top. Yeah, we always seem to be walking out of here with extra P-Wing. Like, you don't need the P-Wing 7 to neither of us do. No, no, no. We do because we have it, obviously. I have, yeah, exactly. it's way faster. Um, exactly. I, I like it. I like it, though. Th this run is nowhere near to the point where it's like, which Hammer Brothers do we need? Do we skip this? You know what I mean? And I like that. It's yeah. like, it's fresh. And it's something that can only be achieved through, like, what we're, what we're doing yeah. right now. I have a feeling we're, I'm going to be into this, uh, even after GDQX, you know what I mean? Oh, you're like, going to be thinking about yeah, it. Yeah, every, every time we get together, this is something we're probably going to have to do, because it's fun, and there, there's a lot, of ways to, a lot of ways to handle it. Yeah, two hands is bad. Two hands is pretty much what we've gotten every time. The person who uses the hammer cannot get cloud. That's the ideal situation. Well, would it be worth using a... Uh, would it be worth using a... Um... Save, nice save. That happened. Whoa! Oh, I almost screwed that up pretty bad. 
Yeah, that's that's the real key point of RNG I'm realizing. And then we get um You need the firefly because you're doing Bowser. Which is good though, because you get the fortress. You get the fortress, so you get it back. I have Firefly right now. Oh, that's right. That's right. I didn't lose it. Yeah. I don't need this. Oh, shit. What? How did I not get it? I was expecting to get hit by the sun, definitely. Oh, good then. No. I guess I could have kept it. I did get bad yeah. RNG, but I mean, I could have kept it for the last, last airship. Yeah, I think someone said what 1.6% for no hands for two of us going. Oh, I probably should have uh, used my star. Oh no, I hit it twice. When is GDQX? Uh, during TwitchCon. Uh, both players can't get hands in the same spot, no. No, once they're beat, they're levels, once they're beat, they're beat, that's yeah. it. Yeah. VC, that's Twitch Prime, if you have Amazon Prime, you can link your Twitch account to it and get some benefits, like a free sub every month. Okay, we're looking at, we're looking at a 103.40 something, I think, I think, is what we're looking at. Because Bowser's Castle is going to take about 1 minute and 10 to 20 seconds. Assuming I don't dip it. Alright. Whew! This shit's complicated, man. I need, like, a brain break after this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm like sweating and like oh my I'm God. struggling here. Yeah. I need to go like bathe. I gotta like clean myself after this. But yeah, that's a significant time save though. Very big. Yeah, that was that was a good call. I didn't even think about the pipes, man. Didn't even think about the pipes. So, it's final thing. Both hammer brothers in two. Hammer, split. For between two and three. And we have to route change depending on how we're yeah. forward. And we have, uh, yeah, and then after that it's route changing, and then we're putting the last cloud goes to. Alright, bring home the. Oh no, you got a pipe transition. The last cloud needs to go to whoever. Whoever broke the brick. Yeah. Take some notes. Uh, I think we have it. I mean, we could, we could, we could take notes while the run's going, so we in mind, so we don't lose time looking at inventories. Definitely, definitely, I think we can do that. Oh no. right there? No. I did. <laughs> nice. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. We didn't hit the 103, but we're so close. That right there. A new record. New world record. Boom. Four, three. Nice job. Four, three. Nice job. That was a hot record. That was hot. That was that was nice. We got a new one, baby. Right on. Woo! We played kind of sloppy too. What's the high score mean? Yeah, we we were coming down at the beginning of that run. World record doesn't mean I broke it. Doesn't mean I broke it. What's high score mean? Doesn't mean I broke it. 
I haven't seen that movie in a long time, man. I love that movie. I like it too. Yeah. Uh, that's it for GDQX is 110. That's which, what we put? Yeah, I think 110 is what we put. Okay, then we're good. I hope. I can't believe we put a 110 not even knowing that the world record was 114. Yeah, we probably should have looked at that first. <laughs> We were just like, yeah, just add 10 minutes onto Warpless, boom. We almost put an hour at one we point. We added 20 minutes on Warpless. Yeah. Oh, man. Now what? Where, was the first two, three, bro I thought we were done with the Beatles talk at the beginning of this run. Yeah, I think I don't think this run had Beatles we talk. We were talking about music, though. We were talking, I was in a box of emotions. A glass coaster, box of emotions. Roller coaster of doom. Hope you guys enjoyed the, the, the poo flower there. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I'm so bad being put on the spotlight. Oh my god, that was so, funny. I'm so bad at that. That was so shit. funny. <laughs> KLM, oh you were just this late. Yep, right there. Oh, there it is, ladies and gentlemen. 104. World record.